The most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long and it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started and we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. as friendly as it can be in the circumstances but you feel the rivalry well exhibition match sounds like an easy ozy game of football peter and a picture perfect occasion until the word pride gets a mention and it's likely to have quite a big say between teams that could easily be sucked into an excuse for another feud why let an exhibition match get in the way of that so these two will be going at it very very strongly Way. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? I'm going to go with Mauro Icardi. He was an absolute phenomenon at youth level, highly sought after from a young age, agile, intelligent, and a real hunger for goals. And he has all the makings of a, a footballing giant. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Brozovic plays it out to the wing. Dushilio tries to get it forward quickly. And Jukic plays a clever pass. A chance! Is it in? Goal! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. That's always a great sight, you know, on a football pitch. Nimble footage, show great balance and a really cool head to finish. And that kind of dribbling is really smart. Into Milan, didn't expect this, that's for sure. What can they do now? Quadro Asamoa tries lifting it over. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass and its obviousness was, was appreciated. He's got away and he has been fouled there. Not taking him long, and that's going to be a booking. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Ronaldo having a look, looking to pull clear here. No, not quite. And it's Mandzukic. Cristiano Ronaldo. Unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Oh, flags up.
Brozovic. Jean Mario, Icardi. The referee's awarded a free kick. He knew what was coming. That's a yellow card. Well, the players are making their point, but the ref clearly isn't interested. He's waved them all away. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? Valero! Oh, what a goal! Sumptuous finish, an absolute joy! They have grabbed themselves an equaliser! Oh, that is a bit special. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Yeah, it's always a dangerous time when you've just scored. You can easily lose focus and then bang, you'll take back again. There's a long ball. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Bentancur. Whistle goes, he's been given offside. Yeah, it looks like uh, he did make his move just a smidgen too early. Dybalik tries running with the ball at his feet. Dybalik plays it forward. Striding forward, facing goal. Cristiano Ronaldo! <laughs> now it's Keita. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Dushilio brings the ball forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Forward it goes. Loose ball, who's going to get that? Well, they could break here. Now, Tweedy, good run, where to from here? Cristiano Ronaldo, it's Cristiano Ronaldo! Another save. Maro Icardi really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Gian Mario floats one over. Bentancur goes looking. Gian Mario plays it out to the flank. Chiellini does well there, and it's half-time here. Genuinely interesting game here, very, very watchable. Two goals, one each. That's a really interesting game, and they head in at half-time at 1-1. So it's back to business. And Jukic decides to play it back. Cristiano Ronaldo. Big chance! Grosovic gets rid without sophistication. Chiellini. João Cancelo. And it's Matuidi. And Jukic pushes it out wide. 
arrêté par là. Whitman Tukic shoots. And the follow up. And it's a goal. And that has only enhanced his already huge reputation. They were obviously hoping for an early second half boost, but there are a few who can truly make it happen. And this is a very welcome tonic now. Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Well, as they say, Peter, if you don't speculate, you won't accumulate. And we've just witnessed a player who was rewarded for his willingness to take a risk, as cunning as it comes. So we have a breakthrough. Aimed long and direct. Asamoa. Deftly done. Bonucci gets into the right position to intercept. It's pretty clear that he's being singled out. Yeah, and getting on the score sheet has clearly made him a marked man now. Ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal-saving. Perisic. D'Ambrosio has gone out. are definitely going about this the right way. Well, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Spot on, Peter. Hits one! So who's he picking out? Ball's loose, who's getting there? Defected behind for a corner kick. to make a great save. Claudio Asamoah really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. And it's Keita. It's a loose ball. Dushilio conjuring up some magic on the right hand side. Dybala. Dushilio. Quadrado. Dushilio. That intervention was very necessary. And that has been clubbed away. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. And he's cut it out. Dushilio goes looking. Borja Valero already, of course, on the score sheet. And it's Mandzukic. Progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Matuidi. He's gone for it! And that would have been game set and match. Matuidi has reacted in utter shock here. For him, the keeper has pulled off the impossible. Into Milan, their final change. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Played out to the right. And a header! Sticks it away! Two up and threatening to pull clear! 
Great header, made it look easy. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Brozovic. Kandreva. Michelko. Into Milan. Have a free kick. So that's it, it is all over. A decent win via a very competent performance. Without doubt they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. So there it is. What struck you most about that? I think we're just about out of time, so many thanks to Jim, and a very good afternoon to you.